Now the next important thing is pronunciation. Pronunciation is very difficult to correct if you have been speaking English for a long time. As you know, practice does not always make perfect. It makes permanent. It means if you practice incorrectly, it will become permanent. You need to correct this problem before moving forward because having bad pronunciation is one of the most difficult aspects of speaking to someone who does not speak English well. The pronunciation lessons here are provided to you with an explanation and instruction. Although listening some audio input is very likely to make significant improvement. We encourage you to record and listen to your own voice. A voice recorder on a mobile phone can serve this purpose. Although it might be tedious, you'll be surprised at the marked changes it can bring. Some pronunciation rules for English words. How Y is pronounced in English word. Y is pronounced either as AI that's I or I. In a one syllabus word, Y is pronounced as I. Some words are by, my, fly, shy, try, cry, fry, sky. In two syllable words, Y is pronounced as I. That is P A R T Y, party, puppy, candy, bunny, funny, pony, turkey, happy, cherry, tiny, penny, city, baby. How C is pronounced is an English word. C is pronounced either as S or K. City, Courtney, Cedar, Circle. When C is followed by E or Y, it is pronounced as C. Like scent, cell, cellar. Center, eyes, cycle, cyclone, cypress. When C is followed by O, U, A, it is pronounced as K. Country, cold, cup, cut, curb, can, cat, cab, couple. Computer. The city has cement. The country has corn. We cycle in the city and drive our car in the country. Now, how G is pronounced in an English word? When G is followed by E, I, or Y, it is pronounced as J. For example, gem, giant, Jim, George. When G is followed by U or A, it is pronounced as G, that is gum, gun, gap, gas, garden, gorgeous, George, wagon, danger. Strange, stranger. Here are a few pronunciations. First, we shall learn what will be the pronunciation of vowels. A long A and a short A. A long A is pronounced as A, and a short A is pronounced as A. Example, cap, cape. Here are a few more examples of the same. At, cat, bat, hat, rat, fat, sat, 
add, sad, had, bad, mad, ag, bag, wag, rag, tag, an, can, fan, ran, pan. Am, ram, ham, jam, yam, app, map, nap, tap. If e is at the end of the word, and a is pronounced as long wall, just like gate, take. Rake, base, race, face, wage, cage, and if ending in r, then car, jar, tar, far. Long i and short i. I d that's id. Lid, kid, bid, did, ig, pig, rig, big, dig, wig, in, pin, tin, bin, fin, win. Ip, lip, rip, dip, hip, tip, and it, hit, sit, pit, fit, kit. Now, if E is at the end of the word. I is pronounced as long wall, like kite, bike, vine, ride, dime. Long o and short o. Og, dog, log, fog, jog, hog. Up, pop, hop, top, mop, art, hot, got, pot, not, ob, sob, cob, mob, job. Now if e. Is at the end of the word. O is pronounced as a long wall. Example: rose, hope, pole. Now long u and short u. Ut, nut, cut, hut, rut, up, cup. Put, cup, pup, up, cup, tub, cub, tub, us, bus, un, bun, fun, sun, run, ug. Bug, tug, mug, hug. If e is at the end of the word, then u is pronounced as a long vowel. Example: tune, cube, cute.